Right. Look at that baby. Isn't she lovely? Dan, do you remember it? Obviously the Big Bertha name, but this iron in particular, not so much. Do you? Do you remember it much? Yeah, well, I got one of my closest friends has still got in his golf bag the one iron. He's joking. No, still got it in his bag. Wow. It's, uh, it's interesting, that is for sure. Oh! Wow. That was a stiff string, but that's right down the middle. Oh, oh, it's with the bunker. What, but still, though. It's still a rocky ship. How was the strike of that? A bit, bit on the heavy, heavy side, but I feel like the size of it. <laughs> something popped off the bat. <laughs> there it is. Who's killed Big Bertha? <laughs> no. <laughs> you can going to have a nice surprise when you put that down at the ball. That is one of the thickest top lines I've ever seen. Oh yeah. Let's have a look. Look at that. That is a proper. That is a proper. Oh, it's got the old Memphis 10 shaft as well. <laughs> this shaft was kind I of like. I love how you know all this. So this shaft was what me and my brother used to call like the in-between. It's like a rocket ship shaft. And it used to be in between a stiff and a regular. Oh. And it was just like. You remember like the old ZZ65? Yeah, the yeah, yeah, yeah. And this okay. is the old, Mem the old Memphis 10 you know blaster. You know your stuff. Oh, I love it. Oh, that's a shame. <laughs> that's a shame. <laughs> oh. oh, we could be playing the bunker shot. We're playing the bunker oh, shot. Oh, as a scramble. How have, have I not square that up? The old Memphis. <laughs> it was all right. So we played this morning and it was. Uh, some of the toughest conditions we've ever we've ever played in. I've never played anything like it. No, it, 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 without doubt the hardest conditions. It was, I mean, men, a mental struggle. The last six holes we yeah. played out there today was it, it, just every hole felt like it was brutal. into, and then if it was downwind, it was very very difficult. But this is uh, Pula Golf Resort in Mallorca. We're here for the for the Challenge Tour Challenge final, the which is tomorrow. We're very excited at Al Canada. And we thought, with the, the weather is very nice, it's lovely and warm, it's just a bit windy, so we thought we'd come out and do a It'll few holes, hey? Well, we don't need to use a warbird here then, no? No, only warbird off the tee, yeah? Right, okay. Might need a, what, what have you got in your watch? Watch is saying 121 from where we're standing, so probably, probably 115 from where that ball is. Oh wow, this is your hole. Bit long. Bit long, that's a shame. That was a Yeah, it was, that was all right, that. Well out. Go, that's... go, 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 chunky. Go, go. Ah. Yep. Oh. Right. You got us covered now. Should I go for it? Yeah, absolutely. We got it. Well, there's the power out. Well done, you. I like that. Good effort. Oof. I have to take the part on a very, very tough opener. So, Dan, this could almost qualify for, a, we've got an Out of Bounds series as well, where it's like the weird and unusual. But I feel like it needs a bit more respect than that, so that's why we're doing it retro. Retro. So, yeah, just looking at the year, you guessed. I, I guessed 92. 92, yeah, so this one's 1996. Is it? So I remember, the person I remember using these clubs the most was Colin Montgomery. Really? Yeah. Okay. I mean, he, made, he, him using them? he made them work. Yeah. yeah. We're talking, I would have been six. Oh yeah, what year were you born? 90. Oh, I was born in 81. Yeah, so, so, you... so I was, I would have been, uh, yeah, I was 15, 16 when yeah. these came out. So you were junior, junior time. I was time. junior, yeah. junior time. So, it's so forgiving, like look at how far, well, and this is what I love about two iron. Callaway was that they were so far ahead in those days, they were yeah. they were literally getting because I mean all this metal around the outside that's just purely MOI. Yeah, you know you could do it's just like, a little hint of that on your on your, like, on your putter, like, perimeter you? weighted. That that was yeah. the actual notes on the thing. It was how far ahead it was with the weighting around yeah. the edges, and then you've got a rather big Hoswell. Uh, uh, ho offset. Yes, offset, and then you've obviously got the the bore through. Bore through, yeah. Shot scope saying we've got 161 yards to the middle of that green into wind. Two iron, just smooth two iron. 
Look at that flag. And that is bending. Bend it like Beckham. Bend it. You, got, you have to bend this like Beckham. We're going to have to start this way right. But yes. Show me how. This would be a good par. <laughs> Even in the scramble. It's gone like a bullet again. No way. Sit. That's not bad. It's on that the right is not side. bad. That come out very, very low. Yeah, I don't know why I tried, I tried to play Stinger and I'm like, I don't know why I tried to with a two iron. Look at that! Chunky monkey! Isn't it? Yeah. Like, if you wanted a bit of confidence, a bit of... Um, yes. A bit of uh, stability behind the ball, you've got it with this, haven't you? Right, I'm adding a little bit of loft, ball position forward, chop it up in the air. Oh, wow. Is that going to stall it a bit? Right side. Get on the right edge. <laughs> what? <laughs> Bit of Bermuda to deal with it. Oh, okay. Oh dear. Yeah? What club you got? Pitchy wedge. But I think it's going to be quite good, like a little feed it. Yeah, it's a little trickle did over the edge. Did you land it? Oh, did you land it all the way on the green? Huh? I've repaired a pitch mark. Was that your pitch mark on the green? I got, yeah. I got you. It just... Um, yeah, it did, yeah. It did land, didn't it? Yeah. Amazing how it, because it came out so low, how it yeah. stops so fast. Okay, this is downhill, downwind, and we had a putt here earlier on today and it was super fast. Oh. <laughs> I chunked it! <laughs> oh, Dan! Save us, please! See, this is what I, 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 when I'm older, I want to be able to do that. Stay there, stay there, stay there. Stay oh there. my! Oh! <laughs> wow. Oh, when I'm older, I want to do that. <laughs> a bit of MOI in his hand with the putter. So we've lent him the Scotty Cameron Newport 2. I pulled it. <laughs> <laughs> MOI or not, I can still pull it. God, it makes me sick. I'm, I'm, I'm so happy that you hold that, but at the same time, why are you so good at putting? Because I don't hit it 350 yards off the tee, so I've kind of had to be, you know? We have this like running joke on my channel about 96 being a great year. You remember... Um, the Euros. The Euros, the Gaza. Gaza, yep. And then he popped it in against Scotland, oh, man. and then he was like, on the floor, like, that was so the good. water bottle on him. That was so good. I'm going, to, I'm going to throw in a little mini game where we've got to get out of a greenside bunker with it as well. Closest wins. Okay. Wins what? I'll tell you what. The loser buys the first round when we get in. I'm going to lose. <laughs> <laughs> mini challenge. I'm going to get Dan and myself to play a little bunker shot. Greenside with said two iron. The problem is as well, this is such a thick iron, isn't it? Yeah, it's uh, got so plenty of bounce out. Closest to the pin. <laughs> <laughs> Did you just put that? <laughs> I did. <laughs> I basically just putted it out of the bunker. But like Al said, there's a bit of... <laughs> that house is definitely having it. Oh, Dan. No way. <laughs> Dan wins the mini challenge. The mini challenge. But you've no, not just won. You've absolutely smashed us. So but, you have to buy the first first round. Oh, is that what that was for? That was that was uh, for a pint. I conveniently forgot that. Oh, hello. Oh, it's gone over. Is that big? Yeah, but it's gone down, kind of down the dip. <clears throat> I fancy your chances now. I've got a question for you then. Okay. Do you really think technology's moved on that much when you're striking that thing? <sighs> technology has, but how, how much has it improved it is the question. It's hard to say, isn't it? Because I, I mean, mean I, like that shot I've just hit there just felt so good. It does. I, I mean, it does feel good. I, I just think maybe now you've got the you've got the stronger lofts. Yeah. And then the technology to counter that with like the weighting. Yeah. I think he's quite well amazing. Like you hit it further, people complain about lofts being stronger. Yeah. But 
in actual fact with that CG swap, it's pretty solid. I think it works for a lot of people. And obviously this is not gonna have, this is gonna have, I'm pretty sure, traditional lofts. Yeah, they're gonna be more traditional, yeah. absolutely, yeah. Right, so you're, you're safe, I'm gonna do one for the old gram. Yeah, why not? Little, yeah. Could be a top. Little, little, <laughs> could be a top. Oh, oh it was nearly perfect. Oh well, we're safe. <laughs> so windy out. Madness. Eight. Hey. Eighty oh. yards. There's been trees the falling tree down <laughs> all day today. Eighty yards. This hey. is how good of a man Uncle Dan is. We've done a video for him today, and he said, "Let's go and do a video for our oh. channel." I, this I just like I said to you, I felt really bad for taking all your time today. Mate, we've had so much fun to create a video for me. Thank you. In this crazy tornado weather. Tornado, yeah. Uh, okay, 56 degree wedge. See it. Oh, that's, that's, I've come out fat. Go, 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 go. Oh, that is so lucky, Al. This is my time to shine. That, it, like the, the whole ground just collapsed under the, under the club there. Go go as well. You must do the same <laughs> as mine. Yeah, it's weird, isn't it? Weird. Yeah, it's because the ground is so like the soil's so sandy and it's coming out of Bermuda. It just collapses and yeah, it like, takes all the impact, but nothing yeah. comes out of it. Weird. Uh, we got a putt for a birdie though, Al. Yeah. Well, it's getting dark. I don't forgot a wee bit sunburnt, you know. In my face. You have man. now. Yeah, you're at the top yeah, it's of your come head. Out a bit. I'm gonna get into trouble about that. You you gave me factor thirty as well. Yeah. No excuse. What? They go left to right? Yeah, well, it, it, yeah, it kind of got to the top and then it kind of wanted to wiggle that way. I didn't go left it there? No, it stayed there, didn't it? Stayed there. Into wind now, it's, a, it's one of these proper stingery ones of yours. <gasps> Say no more. Ah, oh, that is absolutely fantastic. Get up there. It's lovely, isn't it? It's a lovely, that. lovely sound. Absolutely spot on. That's past where my driver went earlier today. You don't get that hollow cavity back really anymore, do you? Like to that level. No, they get filled that, that sound. They filled that in now, haven't they? Yeah, it's like much more. Just I don't know the sound. Oh yes, for the gram. Get up there. Yeah, yeah. Still running. Love that. Either either. Uh, do you know what? It was probably this this year, 96, was the last time I could hit a stinger like that. Doing a natu natural world, I've never seen a duck go underwater for so long. There's a duck in here. I swear, unless I'm losing my mind. There's a duck here somewhere. Approximately 10 hours later. Are you, oh, you're not talking about this duck over here? Where? In the water there. No, there's another one here. It's still underwater, mate. I'm telling you. Oh, it's a golf ball there, look. Three days later. Is it still in there? Unless it swam all the way to that corner. Yeah, yeah, he's, he's hiding under there, look. Get under there. That's a very cute little duck. Little Mallorcan duck. Duck, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Why is he on, on its own? That's what I want now. Well, because his mate's underwater, scared of us, probably. I'm so sad about that duck. The duck will be all right. He's, like I say, his mates will be around somewhere. There's a lot of water he, he looks too young to be on his own. Right. 100 and, um, 120, well, 120 from where you're standing there, Al. All right, I've got, I've got 52. Like a knockdown. Yeah. Hooking it in. Go on, get back there, get back there. Look at that go. Have you seen anything like that? <laughs> yeah, I did earlier when you hit a sand shot. I've never seen my pitches <laughs> move so much. The bike just... <laughs> Is that the pizza you ordered? Is that the pizza delivery? <laughs> Deliveroo. Domino's? <laughs> no. Look at that go. Look at that go. Gone. That's a shame. Madness. We're going to anyway. need to use our um, <laughs> magical short game skills now. Hey there. 
take a bow out. Just take a bow. You're going to go uh, putter, aren't you? Huh? You're going to go putter. I'm going to go 56. <coughs> Push it forward. That's fine. Well, oh, I've duffed that. Go on. I've got this. Right, uh, come on, get us into uh, into the red. Down you go. Get right. Get right. Get right. That's okay, that's just your length. So that. bad. That's <laughs> like, your length. You're so kind, it's terrible. <laughs> it just sort of straightens up a little bit there, doesn't it? It's just too hard, isn't it? <laughs> it's just too hard. But it's too hard. It should be easy, but it's not. <laughs> oh, it's a tough game. We make it tough, don't we? Such a pretty hole, this, isn't it? Very pretty hole. Well, we'll be taking that. That's perfect. That'll do us, won't it? I might just give it one and see if we get some more distance. Al, I want you to tee this really nice and high, like there, and just absolutely launch it. Okay. Oh wow, that's so good. Is that already down? Yeah, there it is, it's up by the cart sign. Is it? Yeah, just short, literally just short of it, I think. Woo! One of the um, top cars in the UK, yeah. back in 96, was actually the Audi A4. The Audi 4 was, oh yeah, the, oh, the Audi A4 was released in 1994, but by 2000, by 96, they'd actually made a couple more improvements to it. How about that then? Oh. You ever had an Audi A4? Never had an Audi A4. I did I like, know. I do like Audis. Yeah. Um, McLaren F1 was the other one in 1996. The McLaren F1 was like the, the top tier supercar. It cost, still costs to this day like two, some at mil, two million. It's like one of the most expensive cars you can buy. Really? Just so, when it so first rare. came out in 96, didn't it? I don't know what it was. Yeah, it was. Yeah, it was. Get the, that's it. That's where my actual driver went earlier. This is where your two iron's gone. Is it better? Yeah. Most modern driver on the planet that I have. And you've got your, the old 96 two iron past You birded it. it, didn't you? I did, yeah. Yeah, you're right. Let's get another one, shall we? There you go. Sit. Like that. Hello. Hello, short game wizard. Where have you been all day? These, these mics will not pick up how windy it is out here. No, I know. It's got to go out. Oh, he tried. I That's beat Uncle bad. Dan in a short game. <laughs> you, hang on a minute. Didn't you beat me around close house in the short game? I did, game? actually. That, uh, that, is such a, that was such a weird... Weird thing, wasn't it? Yeah, it was a great experience. Hey. I'm looking for my divot. Sorry, I can't find my divot. It's gone. It's disappeared. It's exploded. Oof. It is howling out here. And one more part. We've got a par five to come. Yeah, par five last. That'll be a great hole for that two iron. Oh, Lord. Yeah, but you got, yeah, you got to keep up the left, though, because it's up there. Oh, that water. water. Oh, it's, it's a delight. Yep, yeah, that's, that's redemption from the last half, isn't Bottom. it? I just feel like it's a good idea to have clean balls out. Always keep your balls clean now. Par five. There's a bit of a ditch here, you can see. How good's the zoom on this camera? Yep. It's that's ridiculous. What you need, huh? That's what you need. Ah, oh, it's a great strike. No, it's bunker, I think. Towards that bunker. Oh, it short. Oh, it's short. I think it's just right. Short. short now, right of it. I think that's perfect. That is. That could be a little bird's eye view. Just you got, know the what? got the zoom on that one. It, it was could lovely. Could even be. What, what shall I do here? Another two iron in from there. Well, that oh, you've got to go. You got. Unfortunately, you've just got a full, full attack, full send between the bunker and the water. And just hope for the best. And just absolutely hope for the best. Happy? Happy.
Oh, oh my, my goodness. Word. I don't, think can, I don't think it can hit it any better than that. <laughs> it's so good, isn't it? Still good. <laughs> that is Al's drive. I can't explain how pretty impressive that shot is. That, I mean, it must have rolled all the way around as well. Yeah, it's licked out the water. <laughs> it has. Which, where's got, yeah, that's, I couldn't, uh, that's my Sunday that, bet. That's where your driver was earlier. Yeah, it was, there. yeah. Yeah, don't fall in there. No, no, I need five. <laughs> so, what's your watch say? 217 from here, so you've got about two, 205. It's still downwind. It's 100% still downwind. I'll go 79 again. Do you know what? I think you could hit eight there. Front pin, you were back left earlier. I know you I was got gonna a bit hit, of a flyer. easier. Easier? Yeah. I was going to okay. take a bit off, a bit tired. Oh, I've gone really cold. Didn't see it. Oh yeah, just. Oh wow. Are we done? The big bird could be flapping. Big bird. Oh, that's a shame. That was a lovely strike there now. Nut that. Turn over a wee bit. Yes, it bounce. Oh baby. Oh baby indeed. Could it be Al? Could we could we do it? I, I think you've landed at the top there and just zipped it down there. It looks, it looks that way. Um cracking shot. It's been a rooney. Whoa! Look at the wind go. <laughs> Did you see that? Yeah. Did you see that? I saw it, yeah. No way. Oh, <laughs> oh my. Two Dude. under out. I think he's hacking. We got two I've under. never seen someone hold as many putts as you. <laughs> ever. Oh, what an eagle, that finish. Well done, mate. Great. Awesome. The man. That, that, that's the man right that, there. That's been the star of the show, the debadged. Debadged. Debadged Big Bertha. <laughs> A retro review with a bit of a difference. I don't think we've ever done anything like that. So let us know what you thought in the comment section, of course. Thank you, mate. My absolute pleasure. Joining us. One, um, one thing I want to add, though, yeah. is a lot of people say that golf is expensive, of which it is. Yes. To get into golf can be expensive. But for those of you that are getting into golf, consider clubs of this age because. Very, good, very good point. Well, because they, they've got traditional kind of lofts on them. Yeah. So they're very, but they're very forgiving at the same time. Yeah. So remember, spin is your friend. Yeah. It can help you. So the more spin you have on a club, the more control you get from front to back. Dispersions. I think you nailed it because if someone new to the game, you'll see a new review. It's drivers, you know, seven hundred yeah. quid yeah. plus, yeah. and then you start adding all that up, and it's thousands of pounds. And yeah. then no wonder it puts people off when yeah. you see these YouTube videos of thrift shopping almost, hundred quid bags done. Yeah. And it doesn't have to be that cheap, you can spend, spend a little bit more, but you just know that, I mean, it works. Yeah. It still works, and you can get around the golf course if you're new to the game. Wonderful, mate. It's been a pleasure. I actually love it more now it is the badge. It's got a bit of character. A bit of character. Yeah, this is, the, this is the, now the Spanish iron. <laughs> Thank you, Dan. My pleasure, mate. Appreciate it, mate. Thanks yeah. for letting me come on. Of course, mate, and we'll catch you very soon. Cheers, guys.